Up until now, hologram technology has been the domain of Star Wars, ABBA concerts and the preferred medium for bringing Tupac back from the dead. But, like Dave, we're absolutely fanging to see how it can actually benefit society. Good morning, Dave. Show me what's new. Apparently the answer lies in these hologram boxes from US company Proto. Beam yourself anywhere in the world. <laughs> Proto's tech allows people to live stream themselves via things like an iPhone to their patented units in real time. We're able to achieve a holographic transmission with one camera. Energizing. Whoever's beaming appears in the faraway LCD box as a hologram and they have the ability to see who they're talking to via the unit's inbuilt camera. Tap return feed to see the people you are beaming to. While aiming to revolutionise the way we shop, see a doctor and visit museums. Hi, welcome to our gallery. Proto's also partnering with Australian company Tellyin to reportedly bring holographic teachers to rural and remote Aussie schools. Yeah, so we're in some pretty mature uh, conversations with a, a number of uh, groups in uh, New South Wales and in Queensland. All the principals we've spoke to are absolutely on board. Now, this is not a replacement for a teacher. So really what we're looking to do here is we're looking to augment the experience. With federal modelling showing a high school teacher shortfall of about 4,000 by 2025, the need is great. So is the future of education receiving a lesson from a holographic teacher? Or better yet, from Tupac? What the f is a one subject expert can actually facilitate a class in more than one place at any one time. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten classrooms at once and it's something that's very hard to convey until you actually see it in person. And, and I'm sure you've seen plenty of videos and you know, they kind of look cool. Um, but when you actually see it in person, you, you sort of go, oh, holy moly, I get it now. Like, it, it's a completely different experience. David Nussbaum is the founder and CEO of Proto and joins us now via Zoom, which now seems such an antiquated technology when compared <laughs> to the Proto Box. David, good to see you. How can Aussie schools benefit from hologram technology? Well, you can beam in the most amazing teachers uh, from all over the country, from all over the world. Uh, the greatest educators can now beam into the most remote schools where teachers are at a, you know, it's a very well-documented uh, and challenging time right now. There's a problem in Australia with getting the, the right teachers to go to the right places. So now our devices allow people to beam the greatest minds from all over the world to wherever they need to be in real time. And the person beaming in has the near supernatural ability to interact with each person, each child in each classroom in real time. So then how is this any different to watching a teacher on a screen say? Well, on a screen, it's flat, it's emotionless, uh, there's no engagement. Uh, when a person shares a space with another person, uh, there's an actual emotional and physical connection that that student with that teacher will have or with the patient and the doctor will have. Interacting over a screen or, or interacting using FaceTime, you can communicate, but it lacks empathy, lacks a true connection. So what we do is, we create sort of where Zoom leaves off and where physically being there begins. We're having a virtual meeting, a virtual presentation, but it really looks like that person is really there. I, I take it that what you said about 2D doesn't apply to television. Uh, this is an exception to all those rules. Um, we'll move on from that. We, we can all think about a teacher that has really affected our lives, like really quite deeply. Does this really compare to face-to-face -to -face teaching? Oh yeah, so true connection, it is like really being there. So if we were doing this, if instead of me being on this screen that I'm on right now, if I was beaming into one of our proto devices, we would have a more physical connection. It would be like I'm a guest physically in your studio. My shadows are real, the reflections, I'm fully volumetric. It really does appear like I'm there. So it's not replacing teachers, it's not replacing interactions, but it's really just giving more people more opportunities to learn, to educate, to inspire. You can just imagine the possibilities. One of your backers and investors is Paris Hilton. Uh, if I pay extra, is it going to be Paris that turns up to my class? <laughs> Paris is amazing. I mean, she's the queen of the metaverse. She has completely fooled us all into thinking that she was, you know, this heiress. She's not. She's clever. She's smart. She's got a portfolio of technology companies. She's amazing. And I think a lot of students would be very, very lucky to have a hologram 
Professor Paris Hilton beam in um, and teach a class someday. I wonder what she'd teach. David, <laughs> thank you so much for your time. Thanks for having me.